slaughterhouse in here. I know, these things are everywhere. Oh. What are they? Where did they all come from? Don't ask me, no one ever tells me anything. Oh God! Did you hear that? Yeah, and I wish I hadn't. We have to get out of here. Follow me back to the entrance. The ladder! It's destroyed! They've sealed us in here! Get ready! They're coming! Welcome back to Return to Castle Wolfstein. Welcome to the Catacombs. Yeah, they're coming indeed. Okay, can I still get through here? Well, I can. Excellent. Thought I'd see myself in here or out, depending on how you look at it. So, there are Saxon warriors here as well as mummies. So mummies have to be killed with headshot, otherwise they won't they won't stay there. And the the Saxon warriors here have to be killed by not shooting their shields because otherwise they just reflect whatever whatever you shoot at them okay see so see what i can shoot you from behind oh hey come on i helped you out here yeah the best idea here is to just wait until this fight here ends or take some shots while the fight's going on makes it a little bit easier to kill all of these guys here Especially because the ooh, grenades, that those may come in handy. Let's pop a quick save here. And let's see. Okay, let's just run away from these guys here for the time being. You can actually shoot the feet of these guys as well. Okay, you can also knife them because they can't reflect the knife attack, but you can see they did. One of them was bleeding a bit there. Get out my knife here. And let's see what they can, can knife fight this guy here. Let's get into range then. There we go. So their, their attack animation is fairly long, so they, they always waste a little bit of time while they do it. But yeah, just don't get cornered. There we go. That wasn't too bad, because we, we don't want to waste too much ammunition. There we go, let's put, pick up some more of this. Because the undead don't drop any. So we spend ammunition fighting them, you're not going to get anything back. So we can't go through here. more mummies here. Let's see whether we can take some hot shots. Maybe not. That's okay. Ooh, these guys here didn't have much luck, I suppose. Here's your Resident Evil opening scene. Well, not really opening scene, but you know. The scene where, where Jill finds the, the first Resident Evil zombie. Okay, so let's aim at the hat. Yeah, so one annoying thing regarding the headshots is that if you down a mummy and it then you can't shoot the head while it's down. You have to shoot the head while it's actually upright. So that's that's annoying. So if I if I hit the head now, it doesn't get me anything. Well oh, you're wearing a helmet, okay. Didn't quite expect that, but okay. Alright, let's pick up some more goodies. I think. Yep. Let's destroy some irreplaceable historical artifacts. There's some more 
undead there. See whether we can just not bother with those. Let us jump down here. Oof. Okay, should have done that a little bit differently. But okay. Two more of you. Oh, you're jumping down here. Okay. That was a mistake, evidently. Okay, fine. I'm gonna kill you all. There we go. You're happy now? Okay. Oh, there you are. Only there's one of you left. Nope. It's not going to do that. Leave me alone. There we go. Ah, that wasn't particularly elegant. Maybe I should have just gone with the gun here, but oh well. Let's see. Oh, they're definitely going to have guys bursting out of the walls here. Yeah, I told you so. Good, good, good. At least I can get some decent close-up headshots here. Yeah, since most of the undead can't really hit you from a, from a long distance, they have to get a little bit creative here regarding situations in which they can actually hit you. And I have trouble seeing anything here. Let's see. What's it now? Have we been here before? Oh yeah, this door is now open. Okay, fantastic. What's it now? Okay, anybody left here? Yeah, some of the battles here are more like traditional like monster arenas in an older older shooting game. Come over here. I just need to the get these guys to not corner me. You'd think these guys wouldn't go down if you stab them, but you stab them hard enough, eventually they'll they will fall again. Also, of course, they have Viking helmets because they're from like not really Viking helmets, like haunt, haunt helmets because they're from a Wagner opera. Opera. There we go. One of the heels down. Oh, you almost got, almost got me there. In fact, how did you not get me there? Yeah, you come over here. Can battle you. You look early. Your early medieval axe here does not impress me. Yeah, it took a little bit longer, but it does save you some ammunition, and it also makes it less likely that you accidentally kill yourself by shooting their shields, which are very bulletproof. What's it now? Yeah, I'm here. Should shoot the undead. Oof, that was not good at all. But there's health here, so that's good. Of course, there's more guys gonna come out of here. That was predictable. How did they even kill all the Nazis here? There's a feeling all the undead are just appearing just now that I am here. There we go. Okay, and time for another duel. But oh, this guy has a sword. Is that more dangerous than the battle axe? Not sure about that. Oh wow, you went down a lot faster. Maybe, I guess the hits I got in were just a little bit better. So anyway, let's see. 
what awaits us here. Oh, another one of you. What are you doing on the table there? Uh, that's not a table, that's a sarcophagus. Well, kind of same thing, isn't it? You, you're gonna come out of here? No? Oh, yes, you are. Okay. You have the battle axe again. Okay. Oh, got a hit up off, but that's acceptable. There we go. Okay. Did I even need to kill you? I'm not quite sure about that. I can get up here. Is there any way to progress into the other direction? They may not think this is just... No, this is just another sarcophagus. But... There's grenades here. But I already have enough grenades, I guess. Another health pack I can use there, because it did take quite some damage here. Which is still above 50%, so that's that's not too bad. Yep, frequent quick saving here, because I'm not going to do all those dagger duels. Again. Okay. So here we go. This is turning increasingly Egyptian. Oh, hello. There we go. Who's next? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh hello. Just hang out on your own stone coffin there. There we go. More health, I'll take that. I guess you don't need it anymore because you don't look so healthy. Yeah, your your right arm is missing, or half of your right arm is missing. That that's not so great, isn't it? Okay, so kill you here first. Hello. Okay, you get out of my way here. Anybody else loitering around here? No. Let's just make sure the way is clear. Because we have another secret to discover, so we have a switch here, which is not easy to see, even if you know there's a switch. Come on, get through here. So after you pick up yet another helmet here, you should actually wait until the door is down because if you hit the switch at the wrong time if you do it too quickly then you actually seal yourself in all right let's pick up some more goodies here the nazis have sealed us in that happens if i can blow you guys here up Ah, only one of you, that's not ideal, but oh, we have to take what we can get. There we go. Now, more importantly, there's going to be this fire skeleton here. Let's see whether you can, you, whether you can blow you up. No, we cannot. I guess we have to kill you the hard way. Okay. How did that not... Well, how was that not a headshot? Come on. Don't give me that. There we go. Alright. Here we go. Yeah, it could have gone a little bit better, but that was okay. At least the fight didn't glitch out this time. So the door's open again, but we can also exit the level. And there we go. See you next time.